you let the arms hang straight, I always want you to retract the shoulder blades, then squeeze and lift, all right? Remember, we're working the rear delts, so try not to pull with the hands and forearms and move the weight. Move the weight with the arm, just hinge here at the shoulder, okay? So we'll pull back, pinkies up, we'll squeeze out. We're gonna go for 20 reps. The rear delts really respond well to high reps, okay? What's up guys, Jordan Neville's back. And today I wanna give you a quick shoulder tricep that I want you to include in your next shoulder routine. You're gonna get great results from it, all right? So we're gonna hit a tricep, meaning three exercises. We're gonna start with the rear delts first, all right? That's an area that is often neglected, but if you hit the rear delts and train them hard, you'll have great looking shoulders because it's gonna help sculpt the physique. So we'll start with the rear delts, then we'll move into the medial side delt, and then we'll finish with the front delt, hitting all three sides of the shoulder, okay? First exercise, rear delts. We'll go bent over here. We're gonna go pinky out and up first. Number one thing, when you let the arms hang straight, I always want you to retract the shoulder blades, then squeeze and lift, all right? Remember, we're working the rear delts, so try not to pull with the hands and forearms and move the weight. Move the weight with the arm, just hinge here at the shoulder, okay? So we'll pull back, pinkies up, We'll squeeze out. We're gonna go for 20 reps. The rear delts really respond well to high reps, okay? So we'll go 20 reps here, pinky up, just squeeze it. And one more thing, don't try to come back too far. Then it goes into the upper back and traps. The rear delt maximal contraction is about right here. You don't have to come way high to get maximal contraction out of the rear delt, okay? So we're here, we'll go 20 reps, and then we're just gonna turn the palms in. And now we're just gonna swing out here. And there's no certain rep range on these. You're just gonna go to failure on that, okay? So we start here, hands in, maximal reps, going to failure on that. We'll stand up. Now we'll go into a side raise. You'll notice now, there's two sets of dumbbells here. The first set of dumbbells I have are 17 and a half. The other set is double that, so twice the weight, up to 35, okay? That's how you organize the two sets of dumbbells. Want to be half the weight of the other. We'll stand up, good posture. Now we're going to the medial delt. So we're out here to the side, okay? We'll raise, hold two seconds, and we're not gonna come all the way in because that's where you lose attention. So we're gonna stop about here, contract and lift, squeeze, one, two, control, stop here, lifting with the shoulder, okay? Again, try to take out the forearms and everything else as much as you can and keep that tension right on the shoulders. That's what we wanna burn up. You don't need crazy heavy weight to get maximum contraction and work out of the shoulder. So we'll go side raise here, squeezing, holding, two seconds each rep, then we'll drop immediately, pick up the 35s, and then I'm gonna come just pulses, which are just right here, okay? You're not trying to get these up super high. They're heavy for a reason, because they're not gonna move very far. You're just pulsing here to the sides, okay? Just like this. So we got right here to the pulses, last part to the press action, okay, the compound movement to get the front delt more so. We're gonna here, we'll scoop up, instead of elbows out wide, we'll tuck the elbows in, and we're gonna come to an overhead press standing, okay? That's gonna pull a lot of core, and obviously any kind of standing pressing movements works a lot of the core, so we're getting that action as well, so it's double the purpose, okay? But that's gonna pull in the shoulder, and you're gonna hit all three heads, and really get maximal contraction and work out of the shoulder just by doing this, all right? So let's hop into the tricep and let's see what it looks like. All right, here we go. Let's get that work. Remember, 20 reps with the rear delts first. Track the shoulder blades, squeeze. Squeeze at the top. Don't just move the weight. Contract and squeeze. Palms in now. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. 
right from the side raises now. on me. Ah. Now we're coming to the overhead press. Finish it out. Squeeze the top. I complete one of the shoulder triceps, right? So that can be entered into any shoulder program that you currently do, all right? Three exercises going through, trying to get minimal rest between them to make it a true tricep. So throw that into your next shoulder routine. Maybe do one to two sets of that. Adjust the weight where you need it. And let me know how you like the burn from it, all right? It'll get maximal contraction and tension in the shoulder and eventually Leads to a great pair of shoulders for you, right? As always, please check it out. Leave in the comment section below how you enjoy the workout. Leave some tips, and I appreciate you being here. I'll catch you next time, all right? God bless you. God keep you. See you then.